Punches and the more punches, but now Bob's still in there, he's still making a go of it, and who knows, one punch can change the course of the fight, David. It certainly can, and this is a very good learning fight for Valuev. This will actually help him come to the next level if he's ever going to get there. Bob's showing a good chin. Look at that shot he took there. Bob standing standing upright and not going down on the canvas. We have seen him on the canvas in the past, and you know, Bob's showing a real lot of heart in this fight. I can't emphasize that enough. Let's see if we can swing across to Angelo Hyde and <laughs> the listeners. The animated Russian yeah. trainer there, he's really getting fired up. Manville Gabrielle. That was the stumble from earlier. Slip that was in the round. Water left on the canvas there in the corner, which is always a problem. Here we go, final round in this heavyweight contest. And the beast from the east, Nikolai Valoev, clearly ahead on points, you would imagine. But nonetheless, Bob Mirovic will be fairly content at the end of this with his effort here today, no question. And who knows what he can conjure up here in the final three minutes. He's coming out aggressive. We look at Valuev there using his uh, left lead, trying to bring Bob straight onto his right hand. Bob's got to be careful of it. That's just the thing to do, rush in and hold. Valuev is going to tee off in the corner there with his right hand. The Bob up on his yeah, stage. There's still a bit know, of spring about him. You don't, you don't see that very often. Bob Mirovic on his toes dancing. And Angelo was telling me Bob Mirovic's a very versatile fighter. He can stick and move when he has to. He's almost got his second wind up, hasn't he? He was looking very fatigued there late in the sixth. I think he's got a lot of confidence just from going these rounds. Yeah. He's in the final round. He knows he can go the distance now. He's got enough left. And he's not giving Blue Ev the room to punch. And every time Blue Ev's looking to land that right hand, he's closing the distance every time. Come on. Referee warning Mirovic there for extended holding time. Bob's fighting a good round here. He's got the turtle defence up there used by Archie Moore and George Foreman. He wants to get out of that corner. He'll have sound to land a few punches there. Bob's right at the end of his range. And he's got less than 90 seconds to stave this one off. Crowd getting involved inside the marquee at the Nurburg Ring Racetrack. And they dance again. Valuev's getting a little bit frustrated by the tactics here of Bob Mirovic, but he's doing the right thing. The crowd get behind big Bob Mirovic here. Oh, as he's wrestled to the canvas. Hey. Referee's had his work cut out in this fight between these two huge men. And Mirovic's a big guy, you know, you stand next to Bob Mirovic, he's a big <laughs> guy himself, and he looks small next to Valuev. Really, do you say that about Big Bob? But, looks like you'll see the distance out here. Just a half minute remaining. In a way, this is a good win in itself for Bob. There's a lot of people who thought that he, he wouldn't go the distance. They were predicting a first or second round knockout, but he's shown great heart, and he's, he's tried to fight the game plan that Angelo set down for him, and he's... He's done it fairly well, just wasn't able to land the, the, the volume of punches. It's very, very difficult with someone this size. Even you see his overhand right there, it's very hard to get it over the Russian's left lead. Well, the final stages of the fight now. And the beast from the east, you fancy, is going to extend his career record to 32 and 0, but Angela. Wait the result. The expected result of this eight round heavyweight contest. David had to be quite impressed with Valua for a big man. He, he, he fought fairly well. He's definitely improved since we've seen him last. Yeah, he stayed very calm. The way that he cut off the ring was very impressive. He just wasn't able to tee off on Bob. Bob showed his experience there by closing Aussie, the distance. Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. Bye -bye, baby. <laughs> you got to love Bob, oh, really, haven't yeah, you? Could, yeah. He's won a lot of friends today. Mate, he's a fantastic guy as well. The result for Nikolai Valoev, 32 and 0 now across his professional career. The biggest cheer for Bob Mirovic yep. there as he raised his hands. 20 and 12 with two draws, his record now. For those Australian boxing fans, it's not the German tradition to give the, the three scores out. They normally just read out the winner on points as opposed to 
where we see in America and Australia where they read out the three judges' scorecards. So uh, just a, a win on points there for Nikolai Voluev, and we'd have to assume it would be unanimous on all three judges' scorecards. Well, rarely has a, bite of, a fighter been better described than Nikolai Voluev as the beast from the east, the world's tallest boxer, and uh, very much so on the basis there. As you see, the Aussie fans in the audience.